checkpoint, everybody. You just unlocked bonus days. Bonus days, bonus days, and a three pay link. What do I mean? More about so you want to be an author tuber. It's going to be happening this weekend. Let's get started. <laughs> Hey there, everybody. Welcome back. It's another Camp NaNoWriMo vlog. I did promise you an update about more information with things going on with So You Want to Be an Author Tuber, but we're going to get to that here in a little bit. So we had a double down day as part of Heart Breathing's writing community this past weekend. How did it go? I got to host. Oh my gosh. It felt so good to host on a Saturday. It's been a couple of months. So thank you for everyone who joined me. And of course, if you were not there live, the replay is still available as I knock down things on my desk with a hairband. Powerful hairband. Powerful hairband. Um, what else is going on? Oh, I have finished the Act 1 arc of Book 5 for the Myrna Annals. All of those chapters are now over on Ream Stories. We are into Act 2, Part 1 proper. And all the heartstrings are really going to start getting pulled. Um... Yeah, <laughs> so finishing this book by the end of the month is possible, but there's a couple of epic awesome things going on around here. I'm going to be at Four State Comic Con, Hagerstown Community College, last minute. Mm -hmm. They had some spots in their artist's alley open up literally this past weekend. And I was on the wait list. So guess what? Your girl's in. Your girl's in. So if you do live in the Hagerstown or Washington County, Maryland, four state area, West Virginia, Maryland, PA, Virginia, do stop by. The last weekend of April, I will be there with copies of book one, Bound by Fate and Blood, and book two, Bound by Oath and Heart. Now, some of the copies I have are misprint copies, so I will be also selling those at a discount, autographed, and giving away a couple of things. I have some bonus Kickstarter swag left over from Kickstarter 1, like general stuff that isn't Kickstarter exclusive that I can pull out and use for that really quick, and also allows me to update it for the next Kickstarter anyway. Now, the good thing is this gets me in on the Comic-Con circuit, which is a dream come true. Because <laughs> this is, will be, it's a smaller Comic-Con, 50,000, no, 500? Yeah, 50,000 square feet, which that's a basketball court at our local community college and the walking track. It's a big room. <laughs> a lot of people hold local events there for a reason. It's a huge room. So it'll give me a really nice get my feet wet. Yes, there's a financial risk loss at that, but I could be going to Harrisburg Pop and Comic Con, which is kind of, I call it the big brother or big sister to four state. And that's in Harrisburg, PA in August. So my hope is if I can do these, then maybe I can do stuff like Balticon. Imaginarium is not possible for me next year, even though I know a bunch of my fellow authors here are going because there's a festival in Bowie, Maryland in July 2025 that a bunch of us author tubers are going to do together. That is all I can tell you right now. That is all I can tease for that right now. Speaking of teasers, um, next week's going to be really tight and busy. Not only are we finishing the live class of So You Want to Be an Author Tuber on Sunday, and I hope to start posting videos for everybody by Thursday, I also have two podcasts next week to be the interviewee on. I'm being interviewed for once. After doing four seasons, yeah, four seasons of listening to the voices in our heads and gosh, is this season three or four of Soul Care Sunday starting up? Yeah. Plus, uh, hubby and I have replaying the plot. It, it's like I've done podcasts as a host for so long in so many different idioms and outlets. And it's really, really nice to go ahead and be 
interviewed by somebody for once. <laughs> so I will be sharing links about that as soon as those drop because, oh my God, it's another dream come true. Both of them are. One of them's with a local press here in Maryland, and one of them is with somebody a lot of you know and love. That's all I can say right now. <laughs> I haven't signed an NDA or anything, but I at least want to get you all excited for. So, so you want to be an author tuber. What about that? I name dropped it again. Let's go ahead and clarify. There is now a three payment link option over on the page, so you don't have to pay in full. And I also extended it until Friday. So you all have until the end of my writing sprints Friday night, uh-huh, to get paid. Because during my last, like right after my Friday night sprints end is when I'm going to email the, hey, this is your last chance. Zoom link is here. Workbook is here. And slides are here email. So I would be literally logging off from sprints this Friday night, sending that final, hey, see you in the morning email. So I'll be getting up, getting coffee and breakfast, and then 10 a.m. Saturday morning live and recorded. So some people have asked for clarification on that. What's going to happen is with So You Want to Be an Author Tuber, it's going to be live coaching. So when you show up there at class, I'll do a little bit of lecture, lecture. We'll do a little bit of stuff in the workbook. And then I'll literally say, okay, who wants to come up on screen and be live coached on a question about this topic? One of the topics is planning a podcast or a panel cast, since I mentioned them. How do I go about doing that? And I'll walk you through some like writer psychology, business owner tactic combo with it. And then we'll get into actually helping you outline and say, is it a plausible idea? Get you some action steps in the right direction. Maybe start getting collabs going with people who are already there because I'm sure during some of the coaching, because I've seen this happen as a student of coaches, an athlete of coaches, I guess I'm a word athlete. Anyway, um, what happens is you start to go, oh, I want to participate in that. And you start connecting, which is part of the reason why the Facebook group is going to start up this year with it, not next year, like I originally planned. So the live coaching portions will be recorded. Now, what gets out here for free on my YouTube is only the lecture portion. So you get like the first 20 minutes of every hour the people who take the class get the whole unfiltered thing with the live coaching. And some of you are going, dang it, I bet I learn a, be a bunch more than I'm going to miss out on if I don't have the live coaching. Mm -hmm. I can't attest. I teach best when I have a student on screen with me. And I say that as somebody who's been teaching in K-12, physically, hybrid, and virtually for... <laughs> going on 15 years is going to be the length of my teaching career. 12? I think 12. Yeah, 12. If we're not counting like student teaching and tutoring, it's 12 years. <laughs> if you count those, it's 15. So I've been coaching, if you count all the way back to writing, tutoring in college as coaching, I've been coaching for 15 years. So you've got somebody who knows how to coach coming at you with a ton of information during both the lecture section and then we get into the actual, I show you how to apply it. If you decide to go freebie, you're not getting the application portion recording. You have to do the pay in order to get the full replay. Oh man, that's why I introduced the two day extension because so many people had the amazing clarifying questions. So you have until Friday night because when my sprints end, I'm literally going to go ahead and close the link at the end of my sprints on Friday night. Mm-hmm. Send that email and then whoever's joining live is whoever's joining live. You get lifetime access with that live, by the way. So when price goes up and doubles, 
next year, you don't have to pay that difference. You don't have to pay it again. You just have to show up and be like, okay, here's what I've worked on since last year. Let's see what I can learn that's changed because we know the algorithms are going to change. That's why I'm doing it once a year. Give the algorithm plenty of time to change. Yes, it changes a lot in six months. Uh, we'll see how much it changes in the next six months. A lot of people have asked me if I'm going to do one in the fall. Mm. Nah. I have other things I want to do a workshop on in the fall. This will bring be our spring, summer. I have something else that will be our fall, winter. Put it that way. Put it that way. In the meantime, I hope you join us. I cannot wait to see you for some sprints on my channel here, 6 p.m. tonight and 6 p.m. tomorrow night. And then, of course, Friday nights when it's all going to close down. So, yeah, that enroll by April 10th date is now what? What date? What's Friday? What's Friday? What's Friday? The 12th. The 12th. So I've extended the enrollment. The three pay link is there. If you have any questions, bring them over to Sprint and we'll address them there. I love all of you. Thank you so much for everything you do to support yourself, to cheer on others, and to support me so I can continue to do both. I love all of you. You jam. See you in a bit, Space Cowboys. Thank you to our lovely Zomreen stories over at Amaranth's Library and the Myrna Private Collection. Whether you're a human ally, sunwalker, bard, songweaver, merry misfit, or more, thank you for subscribing to our ranks. We thank you for all you do to support us. Want to join our endeavors? Head over to reamstories.com slash Myrna Private Collection. That's reamstories.com slash M-E-R-N-A Private Collection, all one word, where you can access all of my books and more long before they are available at retailers and vendors. Hope to hang out with you there soon.